Former L.A. City Councilman Mitch Englander pleaded not guilty today to seven, seven federal counts. He faces up to 50 years in prison if convicted on several charges, including accepting cash from a businessman during trips to Vegas and lying to the FBI. Eyewitness News reporter Sid Garcia has the details. This afternoon in federal court, Mitch Englander enters pleas of not guilty to the seven counts he's been charged with. He's expected to be released on $50,000 bond. He surrendered to the FBI this morning. He's accused of obstructing the federal investigation looking into him. According to the U.S. Attorney's Office, he's been charged with seven counts, which includes one count of participating in a scheme to falsify material facts, making false statements to federal investigators and witness tampering. According to the feds, Englander is accused of accepting cash, female escort services, and expensive meals from a businessman during trips to Las Vegas and Palm Springs in 2017 and later lying to the FBI about it. The U.S. Attorney's Office says in the Las Vegas trip, Englander allegedly accepted an envelope with $10,000 cash in it, $1,000 in casino gambling chips, services from a female escort, a nearly $2,500 dinner, and $34,000 in bottle service at a nightclub during that trip to Las Vegas. The businessman, according to the indictment, had business in Los Angeles and wanted to increase his business opportunities in the city. That businessman then worked with the FBI in a public corruption investigation focused on suspected pay-to-play schemes involving Los Angeles public officials. In a statement released through Englander's attorney, it says, Mitch is proud of the work he has done to serve his community as both a volunteer reserve police officer and public official. Despite this setback, with the support of his family and friends, he looks forward to continuing his lifelong contributions to the community that has given him so much. Again, Englander entered not guilty, please. He's due back in court next week. If convicted on all seven counts, Englander faces up to 50 years in federal prison. Reporting from downtown LA, I'm Sid Garcia, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. It's pretty shocking news to hear today. Well, coming up, the seven day.